first came to Alexandria to visit and get to know more about the city, I had only basic knowledge of the town. I knew it was historic, mostly for the working waterfront and the history of the waterfront. And so getting to know more of the city itself, visiting Del Rey and West End and Arlandria, really getting to go all over the city, seeing the different neighborhoods, not only the waterfront and Old Town, but, you know, just getting to see people going about their lives and where they live and what they do was really great. I also got to visit some historical locations. You know, we went to the Freedom House, which was a really amazing experience and talking with the folks there about the exhibits they were putting on, as well as going to um, the African-American Heritage Park. And I walked through that space on my own for a long time, which was really really an amazing experience. It was really touching. I think anytime you go to cemeteries and, and just seeing, you know, the, the headstones kind of laid out along the landscape is really, really powerful. And also closer to the, the site, C site, um, Founders Park, just walking through Founders Park and learning a little more about that history. So, you know, Really, oftentimes when we, we hear about different locations across the country and we know they're historical for one reason or the other, whether architecturally, we know they have a lot of historical buildings, we don't really understand the breadth and depth of that history, like what it really means. You know, even learning more about the relationship of Alexandria both to the the Union during the Civil War and you know, the, the, the details of that relationship was a lot more than I had known before. Mm-hmm. 